Well done, Steph. Uh, how pleased are you to come through after the tough first set um, today or later? Great, uh, great game of tennis uh, at the second and third set of the match. I wasn't focused too much on score, on keeping count of the score, and uh, I did a great job there, being uh, uh, coming up with powerful shots, uh, pressing early on um, during the rallies, and it, it felt great to to be at that level of tennis. Um, I was very focused, um, especially after losing the first set. I knew that uh, this is my time to change things up and uh, move on with. Uh, Better tennis with better power and movement on the court. And uh, I think I outplayed him as well physically. I was uh, stronger physically today. Um, at least uh, that's the way I felt. And I think uh, winning the first match today was uh, all due to physicality and uh, being constantly uh, mentally involved uh, during the match. Oh, congrats. Uh, it looks like you've changed your service motion a bit, especially the stance. Just wondering um, um, why, why you decided to do it, um, if it's to do with your back, and, and what it's been like, you know, changing it. Uh, I don't see it as something negative in my game. I might uh, have had not the best uh, first serve percentages at the beginning of the match today, but uh, it's something that I'm trying to uh, put into my game, uh, perhaps with consistency and uh, other things that can help me. Um, Avoiding rotating and uh, keeping my body a bit more uh, compact when on contact points. So a few things that I'm trying to adjust. Uh, of course, I haven't spent too much time on it. So I'm on and off, uh, depending on my personal feeling. I will continue and we'll see. It's always a team decision, you know. I'm not going to do something based on uh, my own feeling. I want everyone involved and uh, everyone that's in my team to have uh, an opinion on it. And as you can see, there are a lot of players out there that are serving that in that particular way, and they have very good serves. So it's not something that we haven't seen in tennis before. It's used uh, by a lot of top players. Anyone else in English? In general, about um, the back, and, and particularly since um, the end of last year, I, re I read somewhere that, like, initially after the ATP finals, you couldn't get out of bed for a while or something. So, what was it like after that, and what has the recovery been like over the past few months? My recovery has kind of been insane. Um, and I'm talking on behalf of players that have had this injury in the past, I've spoken to a few of them. It's something that tennis players have uh, are faced with. Uh, at some uh, period of their career. And it's an injury that's more common than I initially thought. My recovery has been astonishing in a way because it, it's been quick, quicker, in fact, than any other player. Um, I've done anything that I had in my, under my control to, to get back on court as soon as possible. It's a tricky part of the year because, you know, the year has just ended. And uh, you usually typically get two weeks off. And then, then you're back into the court, working on your tennis, trying to come up with new stuff that might serve you well in 2024. And I was uh, away from that, trying to recover, trying to use machines and equipments uh, that I used for, um, for these kind of injuries. And I didn't spend that much time on court. So it was a tricky part of the. Uh, it was a tricky part during the, uh, the preseason to, to be faced with something like this. But now I'm healthy. I'm headed to the right direction. Um, I feel like the, I can keep adding to it and eventually see myself the way I was able to play um, the beginning of, at the beginning of last year. Last one there. Say a few words about your second round opponent. It's either Alexander Dabrukic or Jordan Thompson. Well, uh, both Aussies, uh, they have a great game. I played one of them, actually, uh, last year. I'm, uh, I'm hoping to be back on court stronger and um, show great tennis against any of them and you know, use the crowd uh, and pump myself, pump myself up uh, when needed. I know I have a great uh, fan base, I have a great crowd by my side, and uh, this gives me uh, belief, this gives me 
uh, an additional uh, type of uh, confidence that is uh, that is uh, not typically um, there uh, on on other tournaments. Uh, and for sure, um, I'm hoping to, to to go out there and and show the same level of tennis that I did after the second set today and keep it that way. Yeah.